Alrighty guys, for today's video, I am going to be showing you how to play Vex like a challenger player. I'm going to go over everything from early game, mid, late, builds, runes, strategy, why this champion is so incredibly OP in the first place. Um, and I think I want to talk about that actually. So Vex, in my opinion, is the most overpowered champion, and this is a really hot take, but the most overpowered champion in mid lane. And I think she's also the most underrated. Get that auto. Thank you. I feel like no one plays her for no reason uh, other than that she just hasn't picked up popularity yet. And because, to be completely honest with you, she is an assassin. She is a long range mage. She is a... Uh, she has consistent damage. She has insane burst. She is everything in one. The only thing she doesn't have is good survivability, so if you were to get ganked, you would be in trouble. But other than that, honestly, it's completely insane. Uh, and as someone who has played her in the highest ranks, I can assure you that she is literally god tier. Um, especially in solo queue, at least. So let's go ahead and go for a quick... Let's go for an E. So, let's talk about the abilities. First things first, we've got your uh, passive. Every 20 seconds or so, your next ability, like the red bar you see under my health right now, it means that we're going to fear anyone and everyone we hit with our next ability. Uh, also, there's a, another part of it where when anyone, whenever a champion dashes, you do a little bit of extra damage on your next auto or ability cast. Really quick, we're actually going to see if we can... Good damage right there. And... Yeah, moving on to your Q. It's a projectile that's really slow and wide off the off the get-go. Oh, he's dead actually to minions. Well done, well done. Nice, he just killed himself. Um, but yeah, projectile very wide off the bat. Ooh. See right there, he dashed, so I just get an extra bit of damage. And every time we I should mention as well, every time we proc our passive, it is going to uh reduce the fear cooldown by 25%. So that's also very nice. Uh, we're just going to turn the corner right now and recall. Completely out of mana here, so it is all good. I think we'll have one minion freezing the wave a little bit. Nice. But yeah, we have plenty of time to talk about this beautiful, beautiful champion, I suppose. Uh, so next thing, we have the uh, W. It's just a shockwave. It's just a little shield and does damage to people around you. But that's going to be very important for our ultimate. But first things first, our E. Uh, projectile circle, and it it does apply gloom, which is the thing that marks them and does damage. Uh, everything that you throw out applies gloom to. We can actually press W to proc the gloom on everything. Um, and then our ultimate is the big thing. That is the most important thing. Well, we're actually going to shove this way really quick. Let me go ahead and wait just a second until my E is up. Remember, until my Q is up. Because we do want to use... Gloom mark to proc on everything and then hit our Q. Like that is very interesting. They're not going to win that. Yo and my greed for it. Okay. Just Q all these. We'll get a few waves in. Not going to be end really roaming yet because we just need to hit six. Uh, but yeah, let's talk about the ultimate. It is an obscenely long ranged uh, projectile. That if you hit a champion, it does damage, and if you you can also recast it if you hit a champion, you fly to them very fast, and then if you kill that target that you hit and you dash to, um, you don't even have to dash to them, but if you kill the target you marked with your ult within six seconds, you can reset it. So, uh, or it does reset, the ult resets. And basically what that means is you can keep flying in over and over again. In with the key really quick and get um made a photo proc but um yeah this champion does so much work in the mid and late game just from roaming uh that it is it's obscene you can be zero and ten have three items and then you can get a pentakill um i really think that this champion is just the most insane thing i've ever played uh it's like a cully in terms of broken Ness that no one seems to appreciate for some reason. Although I think Akali's been getting a little bit more recognition 
um, lately in their current state. Let's get a little bit of proc right there. And then we use our W to clear that all out. So those are the basics. Um, runes we got, Electrocute, Taste of Blood. Um, really quick. We'll just... There we go. We got Ultimate Hunter. That is the most important rune. You need that no matter what. Uh, and then we got Scorching Mana Flow for this matchup. I'm going to go ahead and auto this guy first. And I'm going to W him to fear him. And I'm gonna mark, uh, I tried to mark him again, but it didn't work out. I mean, he's not going to kill me, so it's really weird that he's doing this. Nice little damage. All right. He's going to hit six any time now, but I do have my W ready, so. There we go. Right into him. Q gives him a little dash and marks him as well. We're just going to go in. Right there. We hit our ultimate. And then we flew in immediately because we do want to get our W off. Because you can use your W after you fly into an entire enemy team. And you can literally one-shot everyone. Oh, you can, sorry, you can fear everyone. You, can, you can't really one-shot everyone. You've got to kill usually one or two people at a time. Alright. This guy is really trying to get me. It's super annoying going against aggressive junglers like that. But he's a little too late, I think. Because at this point... We have multiple points in our abilities. We have our lost chapter. We have some AP. I think at this point, we're going to be very safe to just use our EQ. And the next thing I want to talk about is wave clear is so, so, so good on this champion. EQ from like from your turret and then EQ again. Wait, let's get this whole thing. Oh, no. I messed up. I should have hit the other one first. All right. I don't think we can get this, but I can look for a little bit of poke. I don't have flash, though. They have a Lux. Seems potentially dumb. Yeah, it was a very dumb idea by me. My ult will be up soon. I don't think Kane wants any of it. I think I'm just going to push then. I really... I don't have ult. It's a dumb idea to even try. But yeah... Uh, in case I didn't mention it, your E actually gets a little bit bigger as you fly towards them. Uh, as it flies further and further, rather. So we can get a max range E up. Q this whole thing. And then we'll just wait patiently and Q these in the back. And there you go. We actually could probably just kill him again. He's going to fly in. And that's going to proc a leg shoot as well. I feel like he might be right there. Oh, he is. Nice. Give me that, bitch. <laughs> Sorry, I've been ganked too many times. I feel a little, a bit of aggression towards him. Nice. And um, we just one-shot the entire wave. The entire wave. With a Q. So, wave clear is insane, but it also obviously gets better since we're getting a Ludens. Ah, life is good on this champion. It's just so much fun. It's so comforting to pick two. Once you get past the little bit of confusion on the laning, like the E, like how far it spreads and stuff, because it, it's really interesting. Like you look next to you, then it, it gets wider and smaller. Um, yeah, maybe you can use your indicator. I, I don't like using indicators. I like quick cast, but you could potentially use it. Yeah, W can also just tank for us, so we can uh, get this wave. We're up so much CS. We're up, uh, yeah, we're just, we're playing at our own pace as well, which is so nice. You can't really get forced into doing much when you're playing Vex, uh, because you either have your ult or you don't, and you can farm from a safe distance. They can't really freeze and force you to overextend to die, unless you, they, you really mess up. You can obviously get frozen against, but it's really, really hard. Man, 4 and 0, uh, Zach, no good. One more Q really quick. And we run for the hills. Nice. Um, gonna look to go bot lane, I think. Top lane and mid have swapped. No Q. They have no win wall. I'm just checking what to, what to do. Cleanse is gone. Alright, my, my ult is in range. 
I should hit one of them. We wait, and then we follow. Get the flash out as well. We might as well do that. That is a double kill. That is old stacks. And that is a 5-0 Vex off the bat in ranked. Uh-oh. I'm probably going to die here, sadly. Ah, uh, W is about to come up, but L, it wouldn't have mattered. Yeah, I have to be so careful against this guy. We'll get some health. Unfortunately, Fedzak is brutal for us, but if we do get Kane to work with us at some point, we will be very set. All good. All right, so Ultimate Hunter giving us quite a bit of ultimate cooldown reduction. Hunt not under 100 seconds at rank 1. And obviously that'll be uh, doing quite a bit better. The crazy thing about this ultimate is that it actually gets longer range when you level it up. Yeah, you wouldn't believe it because it's already so freaking insane, but it does. Uh, no need to jungle. Let's do this, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Yep. Need to take this way really fast. Level 11. I think we just go for turret really quick. Yeah, I got Yumi just in case, but it was very early to use Rift, I'm not gonna lie. Luckily, we do have four people to help, but it's still gonna take so much longer for no reason. Alright. All right, nice. Okay, we're fine. Zach's all the way over there. Oof. What is this noise? I hate that skin. Gross. That is the most disgusting skin I've seen. All right. Um. Ow. I feel like I could actually one-shot them. I think I'm going to try. Wow, they have so much vision. I have W just in case. Yep, got it for the uh, Ezreal ult. Oh my lord, he sniped me! That's annoying. I mean, we get a double kill. So it is what it is. And funny enough, we do get the reset as well. Okay. Almost have enough for Horizon Focus. That's going to be the next item. So... Let's talk about all the builds, I suppose. There are so many different ways you can build uh, Vex. You can go for Ludens, you can go for Everfrost, you can go for a build where you go full Blast Cannon, Shadow Flame, Rapidons, Void Staff, or you can go for Zonias. There really is no proper, I guess, build, you could say. It all just depends on what you're looking for. Against an Lux Ezreal, um, I'm kind of looking for just the Horizon Focus. Uh, extra damage and potentially just poking them out but then against uh you know maybe if i was going against a bunch of assassins i might get a zonias because when i fly in it might not go so well so it just depends on what you're looking for Decent damage. Uh oh. My ult's up in this just a second. Ult is up. Ah, I can't believe that missed. That sucks. It was worth a shot. It was worth a shot. Uh, not really sure what they're doing. We need to get this dragon though. Mord needs to go top as well. We don't need you here. Okay. Yeah, you could probably just leave at this point, but it's all good. Um, gonna go ahead and push this out. Make sure I don't get ganked over the wall too, just in case. Don't even think about it. 
All right, good to go. Um, we are at very high potential of getting sniped. Their bot lane is their best players for sure. Uh, other than Zach. So I need to be keeping my eyes peeled a little bit. But I don't necessarily think we're going to need... I'm going to get two pinks, actually. I don't think we're going to need uh, Zonia's. I think we just need to be careful and control the vision. Um, make sure we don't, like, get hit by a bunch of poke or, like, a Lux key or anything like that. And we should be okay. Right here is a shame we don't have any wards. We need a ward right there. Wow. Just went right into the fear and couldn't move. Okay. We should really get this rift right now before it's too late. Team is refusing to play League of Legends with us. Very unlucky. Okay, they're finally here. I'm like contemplating where to position myself. Oh, okay. I kind of wanted to take it just because I feel like it, it'd probably be good to have that control, but not a problem. We're going to wait right here and see. Wait for our stun to come back up as well. Look at the range. Zach's over there. Someone should be pushing this, I believe. Yeah, if Yumi could play the game with us, that'd be very good. Just gonna wait still. Make sure there's no vision right here. Looks like it's fine. I feel like Ezreal should be showing up any second, but I don't know where the hell he is. Okay, they're just ignoring mid. Someone's, no one's going mid. All right, a little weird, but Usually it would work after two waves, but they're just all grouping uh bot. Just gonna clear out what we got. Um once again playing through the shadows when we can, although right here there's not much shadow play. <laughs> um I really want Yumi. I mean, that's just a free one. Ooh, just kidding. Okay. Snipe this. Wow, that was cool. Did they get him? Alright, that works. Yeah, I'm probably gonna... I'm, I know it's most likely going to get stolen by Zach, to be completely honest with you, but we'll see what happens. Maybe not. Okay, Zach is all the way over there. Wow. What is going on in this game? All right. Just going to keep pushing. But yeah, we are literally just hiding in the shadows and looking to get angles out of vision to get ult off on prime targets. Don't want to be ulting the tank because then we're never going to reset. Uh, and, you know, obviously we don't, we're not really trying to assassinate one shot tanks. But. Right here. We have an angle, but probably need to just. Back up. We might have procced his, uh, his passive right there, I think. Just playing safe for now. 
Ah, Windwall's down. Oh god. Yeah. Ah, we stupid nonsense counters me. Yeah, his uh <laughs> Zach's passive counters the crap out of me. I'm not gonna ever get resets. Uh, when he revives, and I don't, I don't officially get the kill, so yeah. which makes sense, but unlucky situation. Uh, yeah, but we're gonna keep shoving the wave here. I don't think they need to be worried about anything. Nice half health. No one's stealing this away. We're fine. Wow. He literally outsmites it if he just does it right. <laughs> oh well. Um, okay. We'll sell the control ward. I, I have a sweeper. I think that's enough. But. Ooh, where's Yumi? Hop on me, Yumi. Yumi, hop off. Hop on someone else. No? Okay. There we go. I want to flash W so I can get the guaranteed stun on all of them. Nice. Or the fear, rather. And that is a free triple kill. Nice. I don't know why Yumi hates me. I would do so much work with her, but it's all good. Oof. Yeah, it is okay. We've gotten everyone now. Ultimate Hunter. Yep, 70 seconds on our ult. Not bad for such a good ability. Checking to see if there's vision. Nothing to worry about. Just gonna dip out of here. Yeah, I'm good. I don't want to die. <laughs> Thank you, though. I'll definitely wait in this corner, though. See if Yom pushes and one-shot him. There we go. <laughs> That'll do. Alright. If I ever get the Yumi to hop on me and give me all that AP, I will be so happy. And the movement speed from healing and all that. Anyways, um, we are worth a lot of gold, and I actually want to protect that to an extent, so I'm going to be going for a Zonia's now. Uh, they do have a lot of AD anyways, so the stats are good, but it's mostly just because I don't want to die, um, and ulting in, I'll have a lot more leniency to ult in when I have a Zonia's, because if I were to ult in without it, I'd probably get one shot by them uh, in the wrong situation, but if I Zonia's... After I, I miss, like, I ult into five people, it should be okay. It'll be a lot more likely to be okay. Yeah, let's take that. Damn, we do so much damage. Where'd he go? What the hell just happened? Oh, he might have played that really well. Nice. Wow, yeah, good game so far. We played this pretty well. Died a few times just to... I mean, Zach is Zach, and I have no escape ability, but overall, so far, so good. Damage. I think I'm out. I think I'm out. Yeah, Kane's not even there. 
I think I'm good. Thank you, though. I'm out. My ult's not up yet, and I just don't have the, the, the stuff I want. I don't have health. I don't have my ult. I'm good. About to be level 16, though. And that's so crazy to me that we're going to get 500 more range on our ultimate. <laughs> the, ult, the damage is going to go up also by about 200 or so. Something crazy. Alright, let's clear this whole thing out. One more wave. Ooh, I want this wave. I need this wave. Yay, we're 16. Okay, our ult range is now from here. What the frick? This is... It's it's game. We, we, yeah, it's, it's over. It's completely GG for them. This is... Absolutely obscene. Let's try to get it. Man, I want to predict this Q, but... It's obviously going to land right there. Yeah, fuck. I just... I can't risk it yet. Need more vision. Good damage. Good prediction. I'll take it. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> oh my god. Triple? That's three. Okay, that's, yeah, that's 900 gold for <laughs> for a thousand to the tank. And we got Baron, right? Oh, we got it a while ago. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. I don't even care. Oh, yeah, this champion is just exhilarating. I think that's an amazing way of putting it. It just gives you such a fun, like, just rush. God damn. Okay. Um, because you know what? What other champion can literally one-shot all these? Like, this is a new level of broken, consistent one-shots. And um, anyone who knows me knows how much I love those. A one-shot is probably my favorite thing in life. Ooh, good. Nice. Yeah, it seems like you, you me, and Kaiser are a duo. But all good. Okay. What the hell is our range right now? No, don't freaking do that. Oh my god. Freaking ulted him and died. Are you kidding me? Whatever. I'm ending this game. I didn't see the Mordekaiser angle. Oops. <laughs> no, sir. No, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Be right there, I'm literally just trying to get my passive back up and then fear him and keep rocking passives with my auto and whatnot. That's why I get uh, attack speed in one of my runes. Um, is it's just really good for rocking your passive. No! I'm sad. All right, I'm a little bit griefing. Oh no, what is this? What is this TV? Oh, oh, that works. <laughs> nice, no ult, no turret. Yeah, he's dead. All right, yeah, having a little bit of fun at this point. 
Maybe too much fun, I'm not gonna lie. Uh oh. Yeah, there we go. The tank is no longer tanky because you're going against a Kraken Slayer Kaisa. Yeah, I'm gonna say worth. We did win the game off of that, so. GG, well played. Alrighty, guys. That's the first game. Please be sure to leave a like, body the like button, and uh, let's move on to the next game of this beautiful, beautiful movie of the most beautiful champion. Alrighty, guys. We are going into another game, and this time we are going against a Galio, which is an anti-mage. He even has Aftershock, so not the most ideal situation for, I guess, farming him. But I wanted to take a more... Ooh, yeah, our guy's literally inting. Uh, I want to take a more aggressive approach to this game, just to show you guys what is actually possible. Ooh, that bone plating really did a lot for that guy. So for this game, we're going to be running Sudden Impact instead of Taste of Blood, and we're running... Ooh, that should be okay. All right, oh, good. Just going to go ahead and throw some autos, I guess. Um... Might as well try and hit him with the Q. Nice. Get that proc off as well. And we are going to be attempting to carry against a Jarvan. And because we're playing against such an aggressive matchup, we do need to have our eyes on the minimap at all times. And it looks like our Ramus is literally straight up drilling, which is a shame. But oh well. I believe that's enough. There we go. Nice. We're doing good so far. Um, but yeah, once again, just showing that lane bullying is very simple on this champion. Um, not only is it possible, it's pretty darn easy to win uh, every lane, I would say. There are obviously going to be some counters that I'm not too familiar with. Uh, I've never really had a tough time. Nice, okay. Wave is gonna crash a little bit. But we're gonna be looking to build. I think right here we're gonna wanna get boots early uh, and get some potions, just because we are against a Jarvan without uh, Flash. So that means that we're likely to get ganked. It means that I don't wanna get poked out and then be more likely to die. And it means that I need to be a little bit more careful on how I use my fear. But luckily we were able to get back and looks like the wave is pushing into us. Um, but yeah, I guess at this point, without some, just gonna be looking to use abilities to, uh, proc, not bad, get the electrocute off, just looking to proc, uh, mana flow over and over again while we get level 6, Whatever. and we actually want treasure hunter, so ultimate hunter is very important, um, but I do want to try a bunch of different aggressive options just to show you guys. Uh, I would say Ultimate Hunter is pretty much something you'd want to run all the time. But you don't necessarily need it. I just think that it's worth running every time. But for the sake of experimentation, we're going to be just trying out some other stuff. So we'll get this wave in. And we're going to get the Mana Flow proc. Uh, need to drop a ward... A little bit to the right as well, just in case he tries to hug the wall and go around. Uh, I don't want to give him the option of getting a free gank off on me. Kind of similar idea here. I maybe should have warded that right there, uh, that river. It would have probably done more, but I'm looking to just play safe anyway, so I don't think it's the end of the world. And I do have my uh, W ready, so if he did try to gank me the Jarvan, I could just press W and instantly fear him. Looks like it is a falling gank, though. Right there. Oh, it didn't hit. All right, that's fine. Doesn't actually matter. Since we're just farming for six, uh, I'm not going to be really killing this guy anytime soon, I don't think. All right. Should be looking to keep throwing ease out once he queues. And he actually missed the cannon. Because he didn't want me to poke him. That's kind of new. That's rude. All right. Well, it worked for him. I better hit this cannon. All right. We win. <laughs> it's a cannon gaff. GG. Oops. 
I'm supposed to be looking at the CS and I missed the CS. Yeah, I want to get my boot, uh, my book now. Launch chapter is like so important; it cannot be stated enough. Uh, looking to use spam abilities on Vex uh, coming into the mid game. Definitely want to be able to do that without getting destroyed. And it looks like Galar is actually going to recall. I'm not going to wait for my mana here because I do have lost chapter. Um, we don't really need it, need to anymore. We'll be level seven soon. Um, and mana does regen decently fast. So, yeah, I think uh, Galio headed back. I'm going to wait to EQ this next wave. I'm just going to try and push the whole thing at once. That is completely free. So we shove the wave relatively safely. And now we're going to look for a roam onto top lane. Just going to... Yeah, there's no point in hugging the wall, actually. Just going to check to see if there's a ward really quick. That's sad. Um, confused why I'm not getting help here. But, um... Oh, I did not see Jarvan at all. That was my bad. Yeah. I guess I could have played that better. Uh, I guess helping Ramus as well is not the best idea just because he's kind of been inting a lot. Uh, he died level 1 before Midden spawned going armor against a Mordekaiser. Yeah, he's definitely just trolling, but for that reason, it's all good. We just need to not feed into the troll. He could flash at any time. He's not, yeah, okay. So we're not gonna complain about him. We're just gonna keep note of it, that he's trolling, and then we are going to focus on just winning. Luckily, there's a giant wave here, and he did use TP, or he uses ult at least, so. whole thing in as fast as we can Ooh. all right so looking to shove the wave a jarvan doesn't have ult we should be okay to do this i'm gonna get as many minutes as i can with my e mark and i don't think i actually need to all right put a point in w and just uh shield that up i think w is good here just because we are going to be getting barraged by a bunch of stuff you can go e or w but because it's Jarvan, I really like having that, uh... I like having that shield, also against Karthus. Yeah. Alright, yes, I'm just gonna take that. That's fine. Or not, okay. 69 CS. We're up, we're up a kill. Which is nice, but... Looking for more. Need to hit as many Qs as I can in the lane. It is very brutal without flash. I honestly wasn't paying attention to the minimap. I kind of was super tunneled on not dying to Galio. And honestly, we almost slipped through it. So it's a shame, but... One shot the whole way, which is so nice. And now we can literally just safely press Q. No harm done. Okay, he must have EQ'd out. That's good. Yeah, we're not gonna go out on that. Oh, I didn't get that one minion. All good. Okay, I do believe there's no one else coming, so... Good poke. Just going to keep throwing stuff out. Nice. Alright. Let's 
One EQ and he dies, but it's not gonna happen. Uh oh. Goodbye, world. I overextended there. That was a dumb move by me. All right. I'm gonna go incredibly less aggressive. I think it was pretty obvious I was gonna die there. Uh, I just wanted to kill him so bad. Um, it feels like more of an accomplishment killing a Galio who's got MR. Uh, the anti-mage gets destroyed by a mage, but it is okay. Uh, just glad I didn't lose anything. I think, obviously I gave some gold to jungle, but I think having my ult not be on cooldown and not losing flash is probably just as important. And we will have ult soon enough. No ult hunter is a bit of a shame, but we do have a mythic item at 12 minutes, which is decent. Clear the wave out. We are building up quite a lead. Oh no, wait. Oh my god, that's amazing, dude. I am loving this. We should really get some help here. All good. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Beautiful. That was good. Let's go ahead and get a dark seal and start building up more and more ap uh yeah overall that went pretty good i think ramus kind of trolled but that's to be expected since he is literally trolling um let's get this all right Wasn't as cool as I thought it'd be. and yeah obviously when your bot lane goes to mid lane you should consider going to bot but i think in this particular situation the turrets haven't been taken yet, so I don't really know. I think he's just farming bot, and then he got ganked. All good. We're just going to ping him off. Guess he didn't see that coming. Can't do anything about that. Guy's not paying attention. All right, we'll just run up. Might as well try to take that. Um, turret, I guess, is going down, which is nice. No turret has been taken yet. It's kind of crazy. imagine this is a bad idea to continue on so we're just gonna go ahead and push this all really quick um, yeah not much to do here just gonna keep throwing stuff out luckily this champion is so incredibly safe got a nice little 30 CS lead as well We're just one AP item from killing every minion instantly. We get that very soon. Don't even think about it. Whatever. Nearly level 11. I want to keep a little bit of vision on Galio so he can't ult. Someone's happy over there. Oh, well, I guess I did it too late. I don't know. That was weird. still get him. Need a second. Not quite. All good. One more. Yep, 
yeah, we're gonna leave it. So far, so good. I, I thought I could fear the Galio, but I think he flies in the air a little too fast for me. Um, just gonna keep on getting a bunch of AP items then. All right, we're good. Uh, we're gonna lose Rift Herald, but there's nothing we can do about that. I don't have ult either way. Don't think it's a fight I'd want to take. I think we just leave it and recognize that we just don't really have a top laner to help us this game. But yeah, I'm gonna be going for Horizon Focus. Um, I believe I like it a lot. A lot of people don't. Um, but I personally enjoy having the uh, vision for long-term poking. Because, I mean, we have an AFK, Ramus. Alright, that works. Oh god. My ult is up. <laughs> that was a very interesting, uh, very interesting pike ult. Okay. Yeah, not entirely sure how to play this right now. We need to be a little patient. This guy's got- what the- uh, okay, he's trolling. Works with me. I guess I'll just one-shot the troll then. Yeah, we're just gonna play it safe. We are at that point where we one shot with the singular Q, which is very nice. And I suppose we don't have much to go back for, so. Go ahead and take all those, thank you. Vision of Karthus. Ouch. Lost my ult. Alright. I wanted to one shot the Mord. I'm not trying to get damage off on uh, the tank. Just throwing a bunch of poke out, and it's working really well. Okay, just need to see that. I feel like most of the time we're just spamming a bunch of uh, Qs in a very extended team fight, which is why I really love Horizon Focus, just because it gives us that vision. Ooh, almost lost that the red buff. Jesus. All right, we need one more wave really quick. Well, sells for 160, yep, yep. So we're gonna need exactly one wave. Yeah, uh, we're a little low for this. Got a snipe. I have ult soon, we can just chase him. Damn. Still might be able to get him, he might loop, loop around for mid. mid. That's a free one shot right there. Uh, I believe we could take this. No one wants to take it, huh? That's okay. We will not take it then. Six, three, and six. Good to go. Good to go. Alrighty. 
a few deaths early on being too aggressive, but it's okay because we still managed to play this in a way that, you know, ends up getting us all these kills. We played waiting for Ezreal patiently in that uh, spot right there. We've rotated when we need to. I will say one of the deaths was just unlucky that Jarvan was there. Very good. Using the W for Karthus. Completely negate out the ultimate. What's going on here? He's dead. Almost. Nice. That works. Yeah. See, this champion is just so stupidly strong and so hard to kill, too. I think that's the craziest thing about this is, like, even though we... We just have way too much power, and it's really hard to kill me because if you're an assassin, I'll just one-shot you. Um, really use this blue. Damn it. We need vision. I mean, if you look at this, Ezreal is completely one-shottable. Even if he were to exhaust me, uh, it would be after my R2 plus my W at the same time, and he would just be already low. Bye bye. I'll head out. I'll head out of here. I don't want to die. No, thank you. I got my Magi's though. I'm good. Sejuani's a tank. She can figure it out. Oh gosh. Pressing W. And we didn't take any damage at all. Let's go. You gotta love that counter to Karthus. Oh, he's going Axiom Arc. Jesus. Very interesting. Yeah, I will say, this is a different way of playing Vex, but it's honestly good in its own way. I get to get all this extra gold to snowball with. Alright, just running around farming. Trying to poke, farming, trying to poke. We've got pretty good CS. Not perfect, but pretty damn good. coming up, but Arthas does not have Zonias. What? I didn't get him. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I failed that a little bit. I should have just ulted sooner. Uh, I got CC'd, didn't get to finish it off. A little bit of mistakes here and there, but we're alive, so it's all that matters. Not really, not all that matters, but we should be dead. Very nice damage. Yeah, we could just throw so many abilities out so fast. 
Ult. Okay, we got that. We got the dragon. Ooh, ult will be up very soon. Push this wave and get out of here. Yeah, I love having... Uh, I just love having Magi's as well. Because it's really hard to die with Vex unless you, like, ult in like an idiot. You get very much rewarded for uh, building Magi's on this champion. Uh, so the movement speed is so nice as well. What are we rocking? 470-something? Four, four, forty movement speed uh, as the base. And with this, we got five ten. Karthus, I just want to one shot him, but I don't have. Can't do it. Uh, he doesn't have a Zonia, so I could one shot him, but I need to be a little bit patient. Just try to get some poke out. He's just dead then. Yeah. Yeah, we did a little bit of damage. I'm just gonna press W a second we can. Damn. Wait. We all actually almost died. Hey, we stayed alive though, so I'm happy. Probably not going to get this. He's just going to push the whole thing. Keep running a little bit longer. Okay. Just in case. I don't think they can do Baron. Ah, it's just not gonna happen. Can I get like five minutes alone? Cool, okay. Yeah, <laughs> luckily Karthus just doesn't do damage tests with his ult, so don't have to worry about that ever being a problem. Uh unless I just it's like the one time I don't use my uh W or I don't have it up, but the cooldown is so low. It's eight seconds. Alright, we should be good to go. Good to win this game once and for all. That Galio shield is a lot of MR. But if we just keep playing safe and play back, throw our stuff out from a safe distance, it should be good. I wonder if my W goes over the wall, to be honest. Alright, we don't have fear for a few seconds, but if I snipe this, Ezreal should be good. Wait, I didn't mean to press R there. Oh my god. Wait, I hit someone? Wait, what happened? I didn't mean to do that. I, I pressed R on accident. Alright, that works, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, it looks like Draven ran it a little bit i don't think it actually matters too much i mean they'll get like they'll get a few towers but they're not going to take uh, they might take dragon as well actually on the bright side it might look like ramus isn't trolling he's just not very good at the game which is good for us hmm Probably stall it. Okay, yeah, let's go, Baron.
Yeah, I mean, they haven't reset. Should be pretty easy to take it. I think it's pretty free. If we, if we mess this up, then it's not good, but... Anyways, rank 3 ult. It has now been extended by 500 range. Which is very nice, obviously. Still have Magi's. 15 stacks. We're going to run into this so quick. I might actually just chill. And catch them on rotation. Nice. That was pretty good. Just freaking spam abilities in there. He's dead. Aw. Oh, that's game. Beautiful. 13, 4, and 14. And as I think I've said this before in the movie by now, but this champion's mid and late game is insane. It's so good. The ability to just connect from this much range and one-shot someone with a guaranteed fear into every other ability is just insanity. So that is going to be yet another carry. And uh, leave a like and let's get into the next one. Yeah. Alrighty guys, going into another game completely different than the Galio one. We're going against a Yasuo. And uh, this one is high risk, high reward to say the least. We are going to be playing as aggressive as possible. And actually I wanna wait for an opportunity to press. All right, I might have messed that up a little bit. Um, usually it should be pretty close to guaranteed, but it's not the end of the world if I miss it, uh, since his shield would pretty much tank the whole thing. But regardless, it is not good for getting mana flow. We're just gonna go ahead. There we go. Uh, so yeah, going into Yasuo is very rewarding in that every E he does gives us a nice little... Uh, Gloom to proc, because obviously every time he dashes. We're actually going to go for a W second here, I believe. Just because when he tries to dash in and do damage, it will be very much negated. And his shield's back up. So he's got Doran's shield as well. Um, I'm trying to just try new stuff out. I haven't gone W second before, uh, probably because it's not... Not meta, but I do think that it's worth trying everything at least once. So it doesn't really make too much of a difference either way. If he did dash in, it would have been incredibly useful. And right there, that's more damage. Just predicting that he has to go in for a Q in that exact spot since he's pinched into the turret. Get that shield out of the way. Just give him one for free. He's going to EQ it. Or he's going to just Q it. Well done to him for using that W. He just saved himself a lot of trouble. And that's a free one. Okay. Ouch. That's not good for me. Well, unfortunately, all... Uh, all plans are off. We just don't get to play aggressive anymore because red buff's going to heal him through everything. So I guess we wait until level 6 and try not to die. Which is, you know, it's definitely something. It's not my preferred way of playing the game. But uh, I guess the goal is to out-CS him at this point. Because uh, trying to outpoke a Dorn Shield, red buff, Kane, or any champion in general is very much close to impossible. Please don't die to him again. Um, I'm not going to rotate to this. I'm just going to leave it. I'm just going to EQ the wave. Get it shoved out a little bit. Alright then. My B. My B. I should have should have definitely came. Yep. Okay. All good. So giant wave. They're trying to fight. It's just your typical... Typical non-challenger gameplay. Alright. Um, I think they might still be chasing. I actually can't even tell what's going on anymore. Uh, I have no clue where Yasuo is. Either way, it looks like the wave has been 
Hold? I'm so confused. Um, what an interesting game. Nice. Okay, so he's got two kills, but we got 42 CS. Later. Huh? I'll live the game. What? What are you talking about? Uh, I'm actually just gonna wait a second for this. Getting book will be way too valuable here. Leave the game. Oh, that's what he's saying. Play for top and bot. Forget the mid. Good luck with that. Um, I'll leave it muted or unmuted just so you guys can be entertained. I don't think I can actually tilt off of this um, at all. Normally, I would say if you tilt, mute, always mute, but it's all good. This is just a funny situation you guys can watch. Um, I'm going to be continuing on to being aggressive. We have as many items as Yasuo now, so potential for sure to kill him. Nice. All right. Not going to use my E and Q just because I figured he would win wall. Damn. Nice. Got a bit of damage off. There we go. Keep poking him out. We need to make sure we don't end up dying. Mumu doesn't have a knockup, which is good. But still, though, I just want to get the wave crashing. Gonna drop some wards and all that. Alright. A little aggressive. Got one, but not the best overall. <laughs> it is what it is. Alright. Not a problem here. Damn, I want to hit him before his shield goes off. There we go. EQ clear the wave. That's good damage. Not entirely sure where Mumu is, so I need to be slightly careful. Alright. Gonna back out just because I'm not sure. I want to play aggressive. I feel like I do have a chance at killing this Yasuo. But at the same time, I need to be very worried about getting ganked. Um, I think that this jungler hates me because he played bad, which is completely okay. Um, but because of that, I might not be able to get too much help here. But if Malachi helps me... Be great. Man, okay. Yep. Unlucky. That's all it was. Just bad luck. Okay. You see this whole thing. Ooh. All right. Not gonna get much mid lane. We are up in CS, but unfortunately, he's got boots very early. Um, gonna see if I can just get a, a pick off. Waiting for Malkite vs W would be great. Ooh, what the? What just poked him out? Honestly, I'm just happy they got the kill. I don't wanna waste ult. Although, to be completely honest, maybe I should have. It, it turns out we didn't need to, so that's good. But if Samira would have died, that would have been probably really bad. I'm just going to use my fear now. No need to hold it or anything. We're pretty safe the entire lane. Perfect. On my way. Uh, Yasuo's missing. Could very well be here, but... See what happens. Gotta love the ult. 
This guy really wants to kill. <laughs> He's doing great. Okay. Uh, we're just going to press EQ. Uh, no. Shot the back line. Now we patiently wait. He's probably going to use his wind wall, I'd imagine, to stop this, but I'm just going to push the wave out. All right. Oh, God. I did not mean to hit the minion. I meant to just try to hit him for mana flow stack. Ugh. Unlucky. Yeah. We'll leave it. I'm not just going to leave one minion. I can't really go for that last one. It'd just be a little dangerous. Um... Against this team comp, though, I kind of like the idea of getting an Everfrost. Um, everyone besides Yasuo should be really nice to just... Like, if Swain runs up at me, no mobility. Allowing no mobility. Mumu cues me, no mobility. Um, it's really easy to hit it. And yeah, the Windwall is a little annoying, but also, in general, I just didn't have enough mana. Or I didn't have enough gold for the other item. The Ludens. So. No, no harm in getting it. Right. Big shutdown for Yasuo. Good for you, buddy. Fantastic. All good. This is fine. <laughs> well, look at you. Oh, come on, dude. Ah. Get out of here. Ugh. Alright, it worked. We're happy. <laughs> um, surprised he's not continuing onto this turret. We probably could have just taken it. I'm very confused. This guy's... Very confused in the head. All good. Let's see if we can get it without him. I don't think we will, though. Let's try and push this all really quick. No, you don't need to use your E. <laughs> Alright. All good. Uh, I'm going to head back now. And yeah, I mean, we didn't tilt. The guy got four kills for free around my team. Uh, it's pretty much chaos all around the map. But just keep swimming, as they say in Finding Nemo. Uh, but yeah, same thing as always. We're literally just chilling. Gonna stay back, wait for our time to strike with the ultimate. The cool thing is, like, we know when to play aggressive and when not to. It's literally just, is your ult up? Um, and obviously, you know, that's not always the case, but it's, it's a general rule of thumb. Start up. I'm gonna get level 11. Hmm. Okay. Hey, yo. We just push the wave while we run away. Take the entire thing. <laughs> Literally, one of the minions is out of vision, so we just got a plus 14 pop-up. Bot lane is dead, so we're not going to continue. There should be a plant. Nice little num-num to get us back to full mana. Yeah, life is good. Life is easy. Uh, I'm good, Graves. I'm gonna mute your pings. Sorry. Oh, 
Almost. Alright, Pierce already back up. So yeah, pretty much, I think you guys are starting to get it. Um, no, I thought that was going to be a kill. Damn it. Oh, Andy pushed him out. Andy doesn't even get the ult up. I'm out. That's a no from me. Lots of signs to not continue. Miss the ult. Team doesn't understand what they're doing. Uh, he literally kicks the enemy out of his own ultimate. It's a big, big small brain move. Yeah, it doesn't matter if we use E or Q first. Um, I think at this game we're pretty safe to max E second. Don't think there's much going on on my end. Just playing safe and slow. Um, not really being, even getting ganked. I think they're just destroying the rest of the map. Uh, and for that reason, I don't see a point in getting a bigger shield right now. I think because we get more slow and AP ratio on our E, that's probably the best move. Alright, ult's up. Need to wait for my fear though. Okay, holding my fear. I don't want to use my Q to farm. God damn it, I want to one shot her. I feel like I really could too. Okay, this should be a kill. Flashes out, okay. Yeah, just trying to wait in the shadows and find a better target than a Mumu. Oops. All right, now much you get here, just gonna EQ it. And then proceed to farm from a safe distance. Poke them if we can. I mean, like they're just running right into us. I'm not getting in range of any of their stuff. Now the wave is pushed. Good to go. Not bad. I mean, I don't mind spamming forever. Eventually he'll mess up. Probably get him now. I think we just kill them all. I'm just playing this horribly. Good. Yeah, I didn't get the best ult off on the reset either. But we continue. Just gonna keep spamming and keeping out of danger. And we don't need a Sonya's. I think that's. I feel like this playstyle is just super effective. It's like Vex uh, is Victor with all the poke, but then a giant, insane engage. And like, it's just an instant one shot if you catch them out. Like, Caitlyn kind of gets countered by Vex because she's in vision whenever she ults uh, and she can't move, so it seems really nice. Alright, ults up.
Seems pretty safe. that a little bit. Oops, me. Oops, oops, oops. Ugh. I'll be okay. I gotta keep going, sadly. I lost my health, but it's okay. Doesn't have, okay, so he doesn't have zones. I probably could have actually could have just one shot him right there. No worries. Yeah, we'll be okay. Oh my lord, the heal and the windmill can get the kill. <laughs> so Yasuo just happens to be. Going mid to farm the same wave that Caitlyn's on, so bad timing, I guess. And that is my first death. Ouch. All right, um, that's okay. We'll we'll be fine. I'm gonna take a dark seal and then keep going towards the same build. I still hold that we are just ooh, one decent fight away from popping off, and I think it's kind of cool that we haven't actually just completely stomped this game. Because it kind of shows that you can do insane things without a bunch of extra gold. So, let's make it happen. I think it's about that time to prove it. Yeah, ult has like 74 second cooldown. Very low already. Oh yeah, we should have a pretty much a perma CC. Well, a chain CC with our uh, Everfrost as well. Cheat five seconds. God damn it, don't miss them. Oh my god. I failed. Ah, sad. I missed the ult. I got both of them. Well done. Alright, so I got the kill then. Yeah, five assists. I think Gra this Graves actually just KS three of them. Oh uh, well. As long as we keep as long as we know what to do, we can execute the plan. Play safe until ult and then find an angle. Got pink horde in a good spot as well. to this one. It's a whole breaker Lowy, so maybe not. I've got ult up. Caitlyn, press R, bitch. I could have got more. Yeah, I went for an angle, got the Caitlyn, which is good. 
Unfortunately, I think my team is just getting stomped and caught every time. Ugh. Yeah, not much we can do about that. But we can... Hmm. Yeah, we just gotta focus on what we can do. What we can do is... Oh, wait, really quick. Hmm. Yeah, this might be a little greedy, actually. Let's do this. Alright. We're gonna be going for Shadow Flame. Took a little bit long to decide, but it's hard to decide, like, if my team is so, like, not good <laughs> that I need to just, uh, YOLO the, uh, Shadow Flame, or the Medjai's. Painful. All right. Must carry. We can do it. We can do it. I know it. I know we can do this. They might be up a lot of IQ points, but I think we should be okay. Alright, gonna get the Shadow Flame. Okay, I think we are good to kill uh, any of the squishies at this point very quickly. I'm not entirely sure, but I th I do believe we can one-shot Yasuo. It's going to be a little tricky, because he might be good enough to win while... Hmm. I think going for Caitlyn is just the move. I think it's much better, much safer. Pretty much impossible for him to push the wave either, so that's nice. So yeah, we've held this mid turret quite a while. I love this pink ward. It makes me feel so safe just hiding right here. Wait for this thing to expire. That's five bot. Just gonna go for mid. Yeah, uh, we gotta just run. I don't wanna lose mid. Slow and steady, and we can make something happen. No MR on Caitlyn still. About to be level 16, which is super nice. Yeah, Zonia's, I'm not gonna bother. My ult is up. And we do have fear.
I'm gonna have to go for an angle here if we want to win this. I can one-shot this guy. There we go. That's a play right there. Jesus. We should go Baron for sure. Holy crap. All right. Uh, I guess we just don't do Baron first. I don't think they'd be able to do it in time, but it's okay. Did he just smite that? Okay, it's up again. That's fine. Bolt's already back up too. It'd be truly strange if we didn't just take this right now. There we go. Yeah, it should be so free. Okay. That was a mistake from me. I wonder if we just go for a Momo. I think, not a Momo, Caitlyn. I, I think I'm just gonna recall though. Get my Magi's. Yeah, this game is going very, very intense, so I'm going to be getting a Magi's and Blue Elixir. Um, we had a good play, which has pretty much turned this game, I think. Uh, I tried. Bad, I'm dead. Wasn't paying attention. Oh, we're all dead. That was so dumb of me. I actually ran it now. Ah, oh, that sucks. I mean, it won't make too much of a difference. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Although, maybe it might. We'll see. If they go for Baron, can they go for Baron? They certainly can. If they just rushed it, question is, do they know that? Yeah, I think it might be time to get a stopwatch. As much as I don't want to, I don't even think I need to. I think I need to get MR or Magic Pen. I think we'll go for Magic Pen. Yeah, unfortunate situation. I definitely didn't need to die there, but sometimes I have that inner Akali where I run in and don't think about what happens. Because when I play Akali, I can just dash out. Or shroud for an hour. Uh, yeah, it looks like they might not know. So, no problem. Yeah, it's to be expected, sadly. Keep harassing him. Oh my god, that's good poke, good poke. Good poke. Never. 
Bully Bear died now too? Or did he already die? He probably died a while ago actually. Uh, good stuff. I mean, Samira will scale eventually. Oops. Scali. Oh. Got my head out. Looks too typical. I don't have ult. I'll go get. I mean, maybe I should have stayed, but also, I don't have ult. Good timing. Great. Okay. What a fiesta. Very fun ARAM game we're playing here. Guys taking blue. Doesn't have smite? Okay. Good. Okay. We should probably be able to win off of this. Um, yeah. I mean, I made a few mistakes that have cost me my life, but it seems like we had a good reset. Kind of help with the tempo. Oh, uh, man. What the fuck? <laughs> Honestly, just go. There we go. Come on. Damn it. That was almost enough damage. We can do it. Yeah, we got Mumu low, so it's not gonna result in a kill, but our ult will be up for the next fight. Let's get out of here. Man, I love Vex because she's able to, she has so much pressure. She's able to ult you and just kill you if you're not paying attention. Yet she has all the poke and like consistent mage damage in the world. So nice. I muted her a while ago. Okay. No ult, but I don't think we'll need it. I think at this point, 3v5, we can just throw spells out. I mean, if they try, we just win the game. Got a shield, we're fine. Ult's up in 20. Well, a few good seconds. up in 10. I did what I could. 
win the game. All right. That was a good one. Uh, a few mistakes here and there. Mostly just Yasuo was able to run around my team and kill them all. But uh, it worked, so <laughs> that's good. Leave a like and let's move on to the next one. Alrighty guys, we are going into another game of Vex. This time we're against Akali. And this is going to be fun because I counter Akali so incredibly hard. Ooh, but my passive just doesn't do damage with bone plating, which is completely okay. Um, but yeah, the reason we counter Akali is obviously all the dashing. We are a counter dasher, uh, anti-mage, but my ultimate will actually... That really quick. One more for electrocute. Um, my ultimate will reveal Akali in her shroud. So what we can do against her in a 1v1 is actually throw it and then hold on to it. And, uh, nice, we actually hit the Q as well, that's fun. I'm just throwing autos out at this point just to see if they connect. And they are, uh, but yeah. So for this game, we are rocking Electrocute, Taste of Blood, Eyeball, and Ultimate Hunter once again. Mana Flow and Scorch again. Truly dare you. <laughs> I know that goes. Zinjo with Ignite. Oof, not good for me. Alright. Might get ganked in a sec, but I feel like I'd be okay to just survive it. Plus, like, I'm pretty close to my fear of being up. Yeah. Unfortunately, you just can't really lane against Vex as a Kali. You can't really lane as, against anyone as a Kali, but regardless, it's a free one. You take those, you can enjoy a Kali's wave while I enjoy recalling with first blood. Let's get out of here. Considering the different options for spending our gold, I don't think we necessarily need to get the mana uh, crystal early for the mana, or sapphire crystal. I think mana flow should be enough, um, and having the AP and boots will be really good for just making sure we don't ever die to a gank. Move uh, Boots as well will be good for generally just roaming around to bot lane. Bot lane has like no escapes at all, so very high value to gank them. And we, just, we just have to back up while she's trying to get in range of us. Nice poke. Keep hitting them with the scorches. Ugh, can we get some rain clouds in here? Nice. We are just chunking her out. And let the wave shove as well, since that is what she is looking to do, I guess. No, I'm just kidding. But the wave is in a great spot for us. Unfortunately, the second we go in for a, another combo, it's going to push right back. Yeah. That was my bad on that one. Ooh. All right. Wave is in here for a little bit longer. It's not gonna hold a freeze, which I'm okay with. I just enjoy, I prefer being right here, but I also, there's pros to being pushed in as well. I can just shove and roam a lot easier. All right, about to be six. Level six with a double CS lead. That is a free one. I'll be okay here. Sorry, I appreciate your help. I apologize that you ended up uh, missing the wave, but it is much appreciated. Okay, let's get out of here. Get the lost chapter. Um, 
I think because we're going against a lot of immobile champions, actually, they don't have a single champion that has a reliable escape. Akali has a shroud, which I kind of counter out. Xin Zhao has a big ult, which can block my ult, I believe. But in general, Everfrost should be incredibly valuable here. So let's go for that. Good damage. Yeah, every time we proc our auto, we get more and more, or proc our gloom, we get more and more doom cooldown reduction. I didn't even have to flash. I'm happy. Did not have to even flash. Should be okay if she even tries. Nice. Not gonna get that one. It's all good. Honestly, just gonna auto her to get rid of that. Um, I am definitely at risk getting ganked. This is my worst chance of ganking so far. So I'm just gonna reset this wave and run. Now, if Zin shows up, I'll be okay. Gonna hover them. Uh oh. Phew, that was crazy. Jesus, I'm gonna go ahead and crash this. Yeah, it's it's gonna be. Not sure if I need to. I'm not good at wave management. To be honest, I'm not sure if this is a good crash or not, but we're doing it. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. I figured there was a ward. I don't think they'd be able to face check this. And that means that we just get the free Everfrost. I was about to go for Ludens, but yeah, I really do think for this game, it would be best if we didn't. There's just too much value in going for Everfrost uh, against this particular team comp. Just because Brand is a squishy support with no mobility, no peel for himself, no exhaust. Yeah, it just seems like a wet dream to use Everfrost as a chain CC. I'm just going to throw in an auto in the middle of all that just because I can. There's literally no reason not to. Perfect. Honestly, I could have played that so much better, but it's all good. Alright, not bad, not bad. We're gonna head out of here, and yeah, no one's gonna kill us. Uh, we still had, I think we had Everfrost up, I'm not entirely sure. Either way, gonna go ahead and get Sork Boots. Zin, low, probably gonna reset. This is a Either way, it'll take him long enough to heal that we might as well say he reset. And damn. Yeah, so far so good. 
Luckily, we do counter the absolute crap out of Akali. some autos nope. all right reduce the cooldowns a little bit and then waste the fear once again. <laughs> it doesn't really matter at this point since we are... Oh god, that's a big L. Huh. You can't blame. That was all you, buddy. Take so damage. Okay, okay. I thought he was about to blame the top lane. Alright, we're just going to go for level 11 as fast as possible. I'm not going to get it, but I can definitely look for a gank. Sedge is level 11. I think I'm going to start calling you... There we go. There we go. That was beautiful. Yeah. Alright. So far, so good. Let's go ahead and continue on. I think in this game particularly, Shadow Flame is the move. Once again, not dropping the pink cords. My uh, my vision score is so bad. But honestly, I've been, I've been playing mid lane for like 10 plus years. I'm so used to like... I never really needed it. I feel like you kind of, but no one would show up. you kind of know when you'd get ganked. I don't know. It's hard to explain, but wards like don't really change too much. You kind of realize like when you'll get ganked and when you don't. I don't know. I don't know if that makes any sense. I might not make any, any sense at all. Um, let's just take this really quick. There's nothing she can do about it. If I hold fear. Hit me something. Uh oh. Oh, thank God. Holy shutdown, Jesus. That's a lot of gold. Wow, I messed that up. Um, damn, yeah, I, I got caught and then I barely got out. I did not mean to ult what I did. But it's all good. We got lucky. Soraka is our support. By pure chance that we get the heal. Nice. Well done by the top lane as well. Ult's not up. Ult is at a 79 second cooldown. Not bad at all. Just freaking fade away. Well, what's up now? Fears up as well. They do not have exhaust. I need to. I can't stress that enough. It's a very, very important part of uh, trying to get this kill here.
I'm a little worried about getting lane gangs by Zen. I'm just gonna back up. He sees Zen. Odds of a Kali being there are so low though, like in the bot lane, lane ganking. God, <laughs> I'm just too fed now. Phew. Yeah, the levels and gold difference have kind of added up to be something a little bit too much. Damn, I could have hit a. If I hit that Q, Max Range Q for the fear, I would have been able to follow up with a uh, E auto. Oof. Not good. If Botlane can slow down, I can just gink for them. Wave clear is looking juicy. Every silver lining has a dark cloud. Ah, oh, almost. Let's see what we can do here. Good. Yeah, I'm good. I really don't want to die. I'm actually, I can't be running in the river as this champion. It's too hard. It is um, crazy how careful you have to be playing this. Gladly take that blue. Cast a dragon. Um, we could have gotten the seekers, but. It really is somewhat of a useless item uh, in the mid game. It's pretty much you either build it at the very end of your ride. I don't know. I think we got Medjai's. We want the blue elixir instead just to snowball it. Good stuff from the team. I see Bran, I'm just gonna ult him. No, never mind, not like that. Oops. Are we slightly careful? Jesus, that was close. I love having the empowered recall though, it's so nice. Okay, let's get two items. Let's get this. I guess we'll get the Seekers. Don't have enough for the CDR item. Um, I can't get ran down by this guy. It wouldn't make sense for anyone else to do it. Uh, Why do I even wake up in the morning? All right. 
RIP Raka. Probably back up. It is so easy to not die in Vex. For a mage with no escape that flies into enemy teams, it is just too easy. I really think she will get nerfed incredibly hard when people realize how good she is. She is very so it's just so underrated. I get something here. Oh, come on, that would have hit. All right, let's get out of here. Yeah, I'm not trying to die, but... Woo! Oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, we should go Baron. Not trying to make any mistakes this game. We've had such a good game that I don't want to give up the bounty. Unless it's us ulting into the five people trying to get a Penta. That is the only acceptable reason. Oh, they surrendered. No, we're not getting it. Alrighty, GG well played. Once again, guys, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and all that stuff, and let's move on. Alrighty, guys, this may just be the final game, and we are going against a Yasuo, which is going to be an interesting matchup for sure. He has the win wall, but at the same time, we have the ability to poke him out whenever he uses his dash. We got the attack speed rune ready to go. We got the same runes as last game. Um, I keep missing that level one E. That's like my weakness. I feel like I'm really good at like oh, like my macro. My level one E could do some work. That'll do it. That'll do it. We're just gonna pull the minions as well. If we're gonna be drawing aggro, we wanna at least pull them. No. Fear is ready to go. I'm throwing them to Jupiter right now. Um, all good. But yeah, we are going to Fiddle Jungle, so not much to it until six, so it should be pretty simple. And right there, we are uh, gonna auto one, and then we're gonna run really close to this me uh, melee. Just because we want to reduce the time that the auto's in the air so it doesn't get KS by our minion. Like right there, we want to just run up to the minion. Go to the shield. Pull them all back. Use a potion now. Playing aggro because I feel like we have a chance at killing this guy pre six. We're gonna make it happen. 
We gotta play it perfectly. Weird. Nice. Even if he flashed, I would have just killed him with another auto. So, another melee champion bites the dust and loses a giant wave, which is really nice. But there is one slight thing we have to be really careful about. And that is warding up because we officially have no flash against a highly mobile enemy team. So I'm actually going to get boots here. Shoot. What do we do? Boots, this, dark seal. That, that's a good, that's a good uh, item set right there. We can spend all our gold, get boots, and we get a potion. Boots will be the next best thing. Uh, dark seal also gives us a little bit of health. Almost the same amount of AP as a amp tome. And I think this purchase is going to be a lot safer in like every way. Plus, we got Sapphire Crystal, so uh, yeah. We're going to go Lost Chapter because uh, I Ludens and uh, Everfrost are tricky. I never know which one's the best because there's like there's serious pros and cons to both of them. I knew I was going to miss that one. Okay, not going to lie. I assumed... I'm just going to press that in. Uh, I assumed that Yasuo would rotate. So I tried to shove the wave in really fast. Yeah, we could. I hope he's not mad at me. There's literally nothing else I could have done. Oh, okay, bot lane, yeah. I've got my ult ready, but... Uh-oh. I thought my W was up. I'm sad. Missed another cannon. We're up 10 CS, but damn it, still. Okay. CSing is a fail today. That's all good. Let's go ahead and, uh, oh, we don't have enough gold. Later. I would stay for this, but I think, I think we're going to go for boots. We still don't have flash and we're going against a fiddle who's about to be six. I think the boots could actually end up helping us live through this. Um, it's a very interesting situation right now. Because even though Yasuo died twice, he's still so strong. Especially when he has a fiddle CCing and doing a lot of damage himself. Okay, that's good. Fiddle it's down, so that's nice. It's not good they got double. I'm just happy he didn't kill me. Not sure what Fiddle is, uh, or what this Lee Sin is fan pinging. Don't think Fiddle would ever go for Raptors when Yasuo is getting collapsed sword. Uh, he's just being permanently shoved in, so it'd be pretty brutal for him to try that. I'm gonna try and zone him off for a little bit, although. We'll look for a little bit of a freeze. Wish my hood covered all of my face. Whatever. Very cool. <laughs> Love the free kill. There's no way in which. There's no way Fiddle goes for this. I 
Ah, tried to get mana flow, but it's not gonna happen. All good. Let's shove this really fast. Oof. It's fine. We should be able to just auto this a bunch. Can't. This Lee Sin is one in three, looking to ruin my game over and over. Uh, I want to help him, but at this point, I think I mute him, just because I realize he is a huge liability towards me just carrying the game, being that he's one in three, still invading. Make that one in four. All right, ult flash. I'm happy about it. All good. Keep it pushed. I don't think we can do much against this, but I can try to poke. It seems like it's just Ash and Fid. No, okay. They're not even going for it, so. I guess Fiddle's not much of a champion without uh, his ultimate. Nice damage, I love it. Oh, come on, cancel the auto. <laughs> that was funny. Oh man. <laughs> Good arrow, but it's Yasuo, unfortunately, so there's like a 95% chance they uh, just freaking run it down anyways. I don't. I truly don't think I would have died even if he hit his ult. It would have just been closer. Nothing would have changed, though. It was. I wasn't worried for a second. If Fiddle showed up, then yeah, I was dead, but yeah. Looks like the next goal is Yasuo's 0 and 10 power spike. But yeah, holding flash as often as we can. Once we can, uh, if we ever lose our flash, then I'll consider like getting a pink ward, asking for help from jungle, all that stuff. But for now, we're chilling. This guy stopped doing that. Slightly worried about Fiddlesticks. I should probably be very worried about Fiddlesticks, to be honest. I think until I see where he is, I'm going to be a little bit more careful. some reason I saw he was bought and just didn't even bother thinking that he could move my bad yeah and that's the problem I didn't even get hit by Yasuo's old but fiddles fed I'll have to end this lane yeah we're gonna get Ludens uh it's better than Doran's and Dark Seal. I, pr I might get Dark Seal back later but the the Mythic is going to help us push wave so much faster. Which, in a way... Oh, shoot. Nice. In a way, it's safer than having a little bit of health. Because it's less time to be exposed.
thing push my help. Thank God. Ooh. Got the fid. Phew. This guy can summon this. It'll do enough. Get out of here. Don't want to die to fiddle, so I'm just gonna stay safe for the rest of the game. I think this is one of those games where I'm gonna go for Horizon Focus and just throw abilities out. Because my risk of dying is incredibly high. Uh, against a fed fiddle stick, so. I'll get a pink ward and see what we can do. Just get that, just get that. Ignore, ignore your team. Oh, wow. This is some gaming, for sure. I'm not cringing. I'm not cringing. You're cringing. Oof. Well, it's good we didn't die. It's very unorganized. But it's good that we didn't all die. Yeah, it's fine to lose dragon. Just push this really fast. Alright, we're gonna look for a gank top. Uh, full AP, Gragas should be very simple. Let's see if there's a plant there. There isn't, but it's fine. Never mind. He knows, I know he knows. We dead. There we go. That was so free. Holy shit. get out of here, but we'll, we'll help take the turret. Eh, there's no plate, so we'll help him out. No fiddle to ult us either, unless he shows up. But I'll be able to press W for really quickly. No, he's not, he doesn't have range. We're, we're fine. We should be okay. Please don't kill me. Rocket belt flash ult is a lot of distance close. Okay. It's time to get a Zonia's, I think. Maybe not. I don't know. No, I don't think we need it. Uh, if we go Shadow Flame and we get ult, we hit Fiddle before he hits us, we will actually one shot him through the fear. Nice. Now let's just tanks the ult. I don't know why I dropped a ward for Lee into W2. He literally used it on me. That was such a waste. God damn it. Ugh, Goodbye, 75 gold. Goodbye, one fourth of a kill. This should be up. Phew! That was close. I don't have ult. Uh, 
Okay. Got fear of, I'm just gonna use it. It's okay. Um, gonna run up. I don't want Fiddle to hit me. We need vision. I'll show them the meaning of I think I will go try to one shot them. Yeah, my range is so good. Oh shit. Oops. Get MF here. Nice damage. I'll take that. Oh god. What the fuck are you doing? Gotta love your AD carry. Alright, this should hit someone. I knew a fiddle was over there, I just missed the fear for a second. We can just take this, it's not a big deal. I didn't think Gragas would. I kind of forgot about the Gragas Yasuo combo. I think that's like the first time I've been ulted by Yasuo, so. Meh. It is what it is. A little mistake right there. But the cool thing is, I can just take it out on him tenfold. <laughs> yeah. Certainly was an interesting Trist uh, W. I think she's been jumping in. Very interestingly today. Um, I need to... I'm gonna get two pinks and then keep my stealth ward. I like having the option to pink somewhere and then ward over the wall, like pink this brush and then ward over. I feel like it helps you get a lot of picks just by playing through the vision. This should be a kill. Hold my ult to the last second, but... Maybe I can get a snipe, who knows. Ah, come on. Alright, need a little bit more gold anyways. We have one more wave before Fiddle's the threat again. Recall over there, so I'm just gonna keep. I'm gonna run over here. Perfect. Not gonna bother with the ward right now. Um. Yeah, I've been putting points in W and E. I'm like so conflicted. I think W is just. I think W is just good. It gives you a little less damage. Overall, because the AP ratio doesn't go up when you level it like it does with your E. But at the same time. I really like that shield. I really like that shield. Well, I hit the wrong person. <laughs> it worked though.
Alright. Any blue? We did not take that. We did not take the dragon. Oops. Or the. Oops. I'm messing up nothing, right? Did not take that inhib. Oops. Now, this is a good ult. Wait. This guy's just asking to die. Oh, come on. Don't do that. That was not cool. Wait. Wow. He was 4 no. That's, that feels good. <laughs> At least it was 0-3. Uh, or 1-3. and three. Oh, how the tides have turned. Tables have turned. Alright, this, this madness is coming to an end. I'm going back. We're almost 16. I want my ult. I feel like this would be a great time to just reset. Let's see if she gets away. Wanted to get 16 in blue. <laughs> All right, that was toxic. I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Jesus. All right. All good. I still got blue buff. I hope. I'll get blue. Um. Wow, we haven't killed MF yet. What? I haven't even like landed my ult on her. Jeez. This game is surprisingly close. An objective bounty. Uh, no worries. Got the ult. Min bot are pushing, so there's no need to do anything at all. Shot this MF. Yeah. 
Oh shit, I threw my ult out too fast. Alright, I think that's game. Should be at least. I mean, MF can't ult the wave, and we don't have Baron, but no, it's game. That's gotta be game. Alrighty, guys, that is going to be a wrap for the movie. I hope you enjoyed, and I honestly, I really hope you enjoyed, because I had so much fun with all these games. Uh, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and have a great day. Good luck on the Rift.